Jean, if I look at Sunday this week, uh, you'll be probably home in your house in France. You'll open a nice bottle of uh, red wine and there's not going to be much to think about for the coming week. Is that correct? Well, there will be a few things. I still have a few appointments and everybody thinks that I have plenty of time on my hands so they want to take advantage, but it would be a pleasure for me. But no, it will be a much quieter life. In a, in a nutshell, I mean, I know that it's, it is hard to summarize it in a nutshell, but how do you look back at the four years of your uh, presidency? Well, four years put on top of, uh, of another 12 years as executive committee member. It has been a wonderful experience with some successes, some disappointments, but mostly I think uh, we've achieved more successes in a spirit of continuity. Um, if you wanted to point out one success or one, one highlight, what would that be? I think that one is the development of the competitions which are really now major events in indoor sport in Europe and even in the world. The second is the quality of the dialogue with the stakeholders. Let's not forget that we started from a potential conflict and see where we are now trying to build together. Um, one of your focus points when you started your, your presidency was the uh, further development of uh, women's handball. Um, where do you see this project at the moment? Well, if I look at the road that we still have to cover, it's long. I was disappointed at the last Congress that uh, a favorable motion didn't go through. I was uh, not totally convinced that the female members of the executive committee had found uh, a specific way of contributing and that's hard to find I must say. So there's still uh, a, a fair way to go. Um, you've just uh, recently said to the French um, Federation, Je suis recyclable. Uh, if I understand that correctly, um, there is a potential for a future involvement in handball. Is that um, correct? Do you have any, any plans? No, no. I mean, when you recycle plastic bottles, you can make jumpers or uh, tables, picnic tables. This is the spirit in which I work. I mean, I've got experience. I'm still capable physically and intellectually, so I'm usable <laughs> instead of uh, recyclable. Uh, recyclable, yes, but I, I'm not specifically thinking of handball. Um, the EHF will have a new president come come Thursday. What would be your maybe advice uh, for the new president, or what would be the your best wishes for him, depending on how you would like to phrase it? Well, that he may find as good a Secretary General as I had the luck to work with. And um, you've been involved in the EHF for 16 years, if I'm not mistaken. 2000 Executive Committee was, I think, your, your first role. Uh, the EHF is now celebrating, we can see it behind you, 25 years of um, um, European handball governance. Um, what would you write on a, on a birthday card for the EHF? Well, first I've been involved for 24 years in technical functions first and then in political functions. But uh, the best wishes I can uh, have for the EHF is to have uh, another 25 years as successful as the past 25, which would mean that at the end of these 50 years, the EHF would really be on top. Thank you very much. Thank you.